looks just like you, Mama. My beautiful daughter, Jeannie, she has a, such a big problem. Well, now, you just go ahead and tell us, and maybe we can help you. Oh, that's a good. Eh, Benny, Ma, sit down. We'll all talk it sit over. Sit down, boy. Just have a bottle Gina. Gina, very quiet. Did you tell, tell Signor Michele what's your big problem? Oh, Signor Michele, my friends, I'm so unhappy. Oh, boy. Oh. My tan hut. Oh, my tan hut. You bumbling boob, you moronic misfit, you... Well, look at it this way, sir. It uh, kind of makes you an old salt. <laughs> yeah, sir. I want you and your gang of pirates to get out of here. Out, 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 out. No, 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 wait a minute, sir. Wait a minute. We just came off a mission, and now we're on liberty, and we have every right to be here. Oh, you do? Don't yes, sir. Now you hear this, Mikhail. You don't have any rights unless you get them from me, and guess what? I've just taken them away. Come on, gang. No fraternization between Italian civilians and U.S. Naval personnel. Board. Captain, you can't do this. Oh, can I? I can do anything I please. Hey, what it means this fraternization? Does it mean my friends are not going to come here no more? That's what it means. I'm cracking down. If you ask me, you're cracking up. You heard that. Arrest that man. Yeah, oh, wait. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Bum deals. No fraternization. No girls. Nothing to do. Nowhere to go. No girls. <laughs> what may I ask is going on here? Huh? What's everybody just sitting around for? What else is there to do? No fraternization. No girls. <laughs> yeah, but nobody said nothing about no work. I thought I told Mr. Parker to have you eight balls load up the ammo boxes on at 73. He told us to stay here, Skip, while he went to pick up the hand grenades. The hand? You let Mr. Parker go pick up the hand grenades by himself? You bird brains load those ammo boxes while I go find them. Or what's left of them. All right, you Jerry's. You asked for it. Crew of the 73's here, and we're gonna give it to you just like we did those sneaky nips. All I have to do is pull this pin and let... Ensign Parker, it is me, Gina. I get... Oh, Gina. Well, am I glad it's you. I just pulled a pin in this grenade, and you know what that means. Mr. Parker! Escondite Hyde, you're holding a grenade. Uh, yeah, I know. I just told her. I... Oh. <clears throat> Not the pin, the grenade. Throw it! How many times have I told you we're not to play with grenades? No, well, 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 you see, uh, she said, Psst, and I, I thought she was a German. I didn't know Psst was Italian, too, see? So I, uh, I'm terribly sorry that we... Uh, oh, no fraternization. Gina, what are you doing here anyway? You're not supposed to be here. I'm desperate. I need your help. I tried to tell you this morning at the cafe. Well, well what is it you want? Well, what can we do? My Victoria has come home, and we are so much in love, we want to get married. But El Prat, the, the priest, is away. We want to get married today, right now. Well, uh, I'm sorry, Gina, but there's no way I can help you. Unfortunately, I'm not a chaplain. Yeah, he's only a skipper of a PT boat. Hey, wait a minute. As captain of a naval vessel, you could marry her. He could? <laughs> oh, this is wonderful. When you see my Victoria and how much in love we are, you will say, see, sí. yes. But, Victoria. Gina, not yet. Oh, thanks a lot. Victoria. Gina Queen. Hey, he's an Italian soldier. Wait a minute, hold it. Not with the grenades. <laughs> Signors, this is Vittorio. He's giving himself up. But before he goes to the detention camp, we want to get married. Oh, Please, Commander, it will give us something to live for. Oh, look, son, I'd like to help you and Gina out, but this is way out of my line. Gina! Gina! Hey, 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 Gina!
Oh, no, no we're Jesus. being invaded. Oh, oh, boy, if Binghamton ever sees us, we're fraternizing all over the place. She knows it all arranged. Oh, Steve, I'm a Steve. It's Capitan of the ship, Signor Michele, get married Victoria on me. Uh, oh, Greens, and I love it. Please, sir, please. As the mayor, I hold the first. Very <laughs> simple. Hush, Pat. Hush, Pat. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Look, I'm still in the Navy. There's still a war around, and I just couldn't do it. Michele, where's your compassion? I'm not thinking for myself or my fee for making the arrangements for the contract of the marriage. Fifty million in advance, please. <laughs> I'm thinking about these two desperate young lovers. Look at this unhappy young man's face. You ever see a face so miserable? <laughs> yes, look at his face. He risked his life to return to Gina to marry. <laughs> Signor Michele, has your heart turned to stone? I speak to you no longer as a friend, but as a mother. Come on, mama. Well, I don't care what the consequences are. I'm going to marry him myself. <laughs> hold it, hold it. All right, I should have my head examined. You win. Are oh, you such an angel? If he was a little bit older, I would make this a double wedding. All right, come on, let's get this barge over with fast. Everybody down the boat. The boat? The only place a ship's captain can legally perform a wedding is on his own ship. So come on, everybody hurry up. Well, what are you talking about, hurry up? A bride that can't marry in a street to close. We go home and get a wedding gown. See, <laughs> see. Si, si. A wedding gown, but this thing is supposed to be secret. And I got to put on my official suit with a new sash. In Volta Fiora, we don't have a cacamania wedding. Ma che cosa? Rosa! Rosa, vieni qui! Te voglio parlare! Vieni, vieni, vieni! Cito, cito, cito! All right. This wedding I arranged for you is going to cost you very cheap. I'm going to charge you just like a friend. <laughs> Do me a favor, Lugato. Charge me like an enemy. See, so now first. Because Gina is marrying un soldato italiano, I'm going to give you the serviceman's rate. <laughs> Grazie. Prego, prego. Then I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give you the special deluxe menu, including vino a cappuccino and five little pieces for the immediate family. The immediate family? But this wedding is supposed to be a secret. Okay. Oh, when Michaela finds out, he gets very mad. But what's a wedding without the immediate family? You know, can do. Ooh, that's right. You're right. But the whole village. I already invited. <laughs> Buongiorno, buongiorno. Una <laughs> fraternization of boom! <laughs> Now, hurry up. We're all going to meet at my cousin Luigi's farmer house, which I have a donate as a waiting room. Ah! 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 Oh, did you see the looks on their faces, Carpenter? Why, they hate me. I tell those people I hate me. Oh, you, sir? How could anyone hate you? you? You're so kind, so generous, so lovable. I know, so I know. Must be that no fraternization order. That's all I can think of. But I'm telling you, Carpenter, that order is going to be enforced. You understand that? Enforced, enforced. Oh. Oh, goodness, sir. Even the buildings hate me. I still like you, sir. Oh, shut up. Answer that thing. I'm not in. I don't care who it is. I'm not in. Yes, sir. Captain Binghamton's office. Who? It's the general, sir. I'm sorry, General. He's out. Give me that. Hello, General. I, I, I just got back. Uh, I was out at the big reception, General. The, the people were giving a parade in my honor. And they were throwing things, uh, uh, like flowers. Throwing flowers. Uh, their beloved military governor. <laughs> yes. Uh, uh, Lieutenant, would you shut the window? I can't hear the General with the people cheering. Sir, there's nobody out there cheering. Uh, I, yes, General, you were saying? The... Oh, Under Secretary of State Gilbert is coming here? Today, he's coming. Oh, so what a pleasant shock. I'm so surprised. Oh, yes, yes, General. I'll arrange quite a, a, a nice reception for, for the under secretary. I'll, I'll, I'll see you then, General. <laughs> Sir, did, did you say under secretary of state? He's touring all of the towns to check the attitude of the Italian civilians toward their military governors. 
the general is greatly pleased that I'm loved. <laughs> Sir, they hate you. Don't remind me. I know what they mean. We have got just two hours to change hate into love. Now, I want a band. I want the town filled with flowers. flowers. And I want a reception of both the civilian and military personnel. Oh, but, sir, that's fraternization. What about your order? Take the orders down. I don't care about the All the signs must... I gotta be loved. They have to love me. But, sir, I'll tell them. Don't that. tell them, Elroy. Thank Thank them. Love. Love. I've got to be loved. <laughs> Hello? Where'd everybody go? Sir? Yeah, well, it's about time. Is my welcoming committee ready? Well, 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 well. well. Oh, I'm afraid it's not very well, sir. I don't understand. I checked all over. There's not a civilian in town. It's like a ghost town out there. Are you trying to tell me that those were ghosts who were booing me out there today? Now, you get back up oh, but... and you find me some happy, cheering Italians. But, sir... I'm telling you, it's the Russian front for you. Oh, oh, oh. You know how easily you catch cold. Oh, yes, sir, I know my sinuses are erect. But please, sir, I tried. I ran. I was no, all no over excuses, town. No I excuses. Was... Now, for the naval part of this thing, I want all of the PT boats under my command. You oh, yes. Now, I will greet the VIPs from the bridge of the 111. Oh, the 111 isn't in port, sir. It's out on a mission. What is it doing out of the mission? The war, sir. Oh, that. Well, you do. <laughs> well the 114. I oh, that isn't I'll important either, the... sir. As a matter of fact, all of our boats are out except for one. Don't tell me. The 73. I told you not to tell me. Oh, I told you, sir. Well, I'll call Mikhail. I'll tell him to disinfect that garbage scow of his and... In the meantime, you round me up a crowd of happy, cheering Italian civilians, because if anything goes wrong, I'll... I'll, I'll... Yes, sir, yes, sir. <laughs> Excuse me, sir. It's just that the thought of that Russian front and my sinuses just Would explode. Stop standing around my office, spreading germs around I, I, here. I... Get out. Get out. Get out. Get me the happy, cheering Italians. Out! <laughs> oh, I'm terribly sorry, sir. Oh, but nobody will notice, sir. It's white on white. <laughs> if he wasn't the only man that spoke to me, I... <laughs> well, what's taking him so long? What's keeping him? How long does it take to put on a wedding gown? Skip, can I borrow a spare hanky? These things always crack me up. Hey, Senor Mikhail, I want to thank you and all my new Americano friends for dressing so nice and white for this happy occasion. It's okay, Vittorio. Yeah. yeah, it's our pleasure. Yeah, it'll be a pleasure, all right, if Captain Binghamton ever finds out about this happy occasion. We'll all be dressed in black. <laughs> I'm giving them exactly two more minutes flat, and I'm calling out the holy... The holy Toledo, will you look what's coming? <laughs> Silenzio, silenzio. 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 Silenzio, silen
Silencio, silencio. My dinner is getting ruined. Your dinner, you shot it. All right, all right, what's the use? Come on, let's get out with this wedding ceremony. And come on, Vittorio, Gino, join hands. Come on. Where's Vittorio? Here, Capitano, I'm trying to get through. Well, come on, come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. So Oh, Let's see. I have to ask if there's anyone here who has a reason why this couple should not be joined in wedlock. Uh, speak now or forever hold your peace. I have. I have. Stop the wedding. Who's the double maker? Skip condition red. Jeep approaching with Captain Binghamton. Oh, oh, a dead blasted old. Poor Columbia. Now go right. Everybody off the boat. Hey, Gina! What about my wedding? What about my catered dinner? The beach is getting cold and the antipastos are getting hot. Jeep closing fast, range 300 yards. There's no time to get them off the boat. Too late to get them off the boat. Too late to get off of the boat. Right, open the hatches. Open the hatches. Get them below. Down below. All right. Everybody, Move on. Listen. Come on. Come on. Be careful of the wedding gown. It's okay. rented. It's rented. Come on, let's go. Honey, I'm on you. I'm so with the food. Chuck! Chuck! Where the hell? Chuck! Sorry, Skip, I got pulled in by the suction. Chuck, come on, keep moving, keep moving. Hurry up, hurry up. Take her, take her. How close? 100 yards. 100 yards. Now I leave me that door. Come on, come on, you guys, stuff them in there. Well, come on, Mama. <laughs> inhale, inhale. I am, I am, and don't forget I'm not very grateful. <laughs> All right, come on. Look alive, look alive, look alive. Come on. Ten, hut. Mikhail, why don't you answer your telephone? Oh, Captain, am I glad to see you. Yes, sir. You are? Yes, sir. Get your hands off me. You still didn't cut your nails. Why are you glad to see me? Yeah, well, uh, sir, uh, you see, uh, our Jeep broke down, and we were just coming over to your office, so now you can give us a lift. <laughs> uh, boy, you sure look great in your dress white. Yes, sir. Boy, I always said white was your color. It goes into your collection. Oh, you fool, Bueller. And what are all these men doing in their dress whites? What is this? Why, what? Why, why? Well, uh, what are we doing in our dress whites? Well, uh, you see, sir, uh, but, but the same reason you're dressed in your dress whites, sir. You mean he was invited to the wedding, too? <laughs> Couldn't be for the same reason. You don't know the Undersecretary of State is coming. I tried to get you on the phone to tell you you wouldn't answer the phone. Now, what are you up to? Why, why, why? Well, Captain, we're not up to anything, honest. So we're just get in the Jeep or we'll, we'll get... We're not getting in the Jeep. We're getting in the boat. And we're going to the town dock. In the boat to the town uh, In the 70... Well, you can't, sir. Not in the 73. The, the, uh, the, uh, the, the bilges. The bilges are leaking. Yes, sir. <laughs> the bilges. Yeah, yes. and besides, we got rats. Rat, what rats? The rats. You know, those things, the beady eyes. Got to kill them with a stick. <laughs> oh, I wish I had a stick right now. I'd be... I've heard enough of this. Stop it. Get out of here. Now, now Captain... I'm... Attention! All right, man, on board. Attention! What is with this attention business? Now, I am forced to use your boat to welcome some VIPs. So nothing better go wrong. Our heads will roll. Uh, yes, sir. You bet, sir. Uh, well, now, now, Captain, I, I'd like to explain. There'll be no explanations necessary. This is all the explaining I need. So that's why you and your goons are in your dress whites. You're expecting girls on board, right? <laughs> now, Captain, whatever makes you think a thing like that? <laughs> oh, don't you bet your baby blues at me, Mikhail. What do you think would make me think of that? I want to tell you if I catch any Italian civilians on this boat, I'm going to... What's that? Uh, well, uh, 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 the bilge, sir, the bilge. I thought I told you guys to oil those valves. I'm going to oil the valves. <laughs> Something funny going on here. There's something very strange in the air. I can smell it. I really can smell it. This boat has a distinct odor of garlic. I got garlic, sir? Well, it's no wonder, sir. Uh, after all, we've been fighting in Italian waters. I've had enough of this nonsense. It's all engine started. I mean, and, and, and besides, Captain, we, we can't get the engine started because the, the starter button is jammed. Oh, no, it isn't, Skid. It works all right. Watch. <laughs> Oops. Uh, Oops is right. Now, I've had enough of this. You steer a straight course for the town dock, or I'm going to have you up for insubordination. All ahead, full. Bill! The town dock, aye, aye, sir. Now, when is the wedding? The people down here are asking for a refund. Don't give them the refund. You can always sell tickets to our court martial. Hey, that's a good. <laughs> Come on, Swabby. 
I mean, snap two. Come on, man, come on. All right, now, the one reason I want all you men to look alive is because I'm... <laughs> Here comes my Italian welcoming committee. I knew Carpenter wouldn't let me down. That is a mob of wildly cheering Italians. That bumble brain, he did it to me again. A uh, VIP launch approaching. Oh, right there, sir. Glasses, squirrely glasses. <laughs> oh, now it's the undersecretary and the general. And they've got photographers with them. <laughs> I would give anything for a mob of wildly cheering Italians. <laughs> Carpenter, will you quit that with the book? <laughs> you would, sir? Anything, anything. Uh, well, uh, well, sir, would you forgive my crew for uh, any breach of regulations that unfortunately may have occurred in the last 24 hours? Yes, yes, yes. How? Oh, make them cross his heart and hope to die. Uh, cross your heart and hope to Oh, no, no. Come on, boys. Open up the hatches. Come on, let him out. Hurry up, boys. Let him double. Oh, I'm terribly sorry, madam. I'm just so upset today, I don't know what I... Mikhail, who is this lady? Well, what's going on here? Well, 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 well you'd you, you give no. anything just to hear some happy, cheering Italians, so... Hip, hip! Hey! <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, that's very nice, but who are these people? I mean, what is that girl doing in the wedding dress? Michael is going to marry her to Vittorio, and I'm going to cater the dinner. Eh? Congratulations. Who is Vittorio? Oh, he's an Italian soldier, but an awfully nice boy. An Italian soldier is getting married on an American TPT boat? Well, well, now, Captain, you said you'd forgive us anything, remember? Oh, now, forget it. You've just gone too far this time. An unauthorized wedding on a PT boat and harboring an enemy soldier. Oh, VIP man. launch approaching fast. Listen, Capitano, if you don't keep your promise, we're going to boo. They can really boo, too. Oh, I know, I know. Allora, uno, due. No, 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 no. You, you win. She can get married. <laughs> no punishment? No punishment. Huh. Hi, everybody. Laugh, cheer. How do you say laugh in Italian? Uh, ridete, ridete! <laughs> I'll give my men a well done, General. Bye-bye. Yeah. Hey, Captain Apollo, you really came out of that one smelling like a rose. <laughs> you pulled another fast one on me, didn't you, Mikhail? But I'll get even with you yet. Yeah, first of first, you've got to get even with me. You owe me 150 lire for the wedding dinner. <laughs> 150 lira for cold pizza and hot antipasto? That's all right. 50 liters for you, 100 liters for Mikhail's boys. I put them down as you guess. Oh, yes, you did. Kill Robert? Get out of my no. office. Get out no. of my wait, office. Wait, wait, wait. Out, out, out. You're, you're, you're forgetting how you want to be loved. Ah, you're forgetting how well done, too. I'll give you a well done in the election. 125. Get out of my office. Out, out.